Welcome to Fallout 76, this is Jim. Once in a while we'll get a weekly. Collect Brain Fungus, 20 for 1000 score. Showing 1250 for me because I'm using a booster right now which gives me 25% more. Showed you a great location just the other day for Brain Fungus. It was right over here at the abandoned waste dump. Site of two or three death claws. Now, if you haven't picked up that brain fungus the other day, you should be good. Be able to finish this weekly right at that being a waste up. There should be enough in that uh, cavern. And where I'm at today, we're at the Windigo Cave. Let's go aside here. Oh, of course. <laughs> See that cat go? <laughs> God, those ghouls are uh, something else, man. Something else. So the Windigo Cave can be a little challenging for some folks. Just an FYI. If you're low level, you might want to bring a friend with you. <laughs> but um, when you're checking for brain fungus, all right? Check the ceilings, check the walls, check the little... Places now you see how I picked that up. Alright. It only counts as one. Now sometimes if you harvest stuff, it'll come up at the top left hand corner of the screen and might show like two or three. Alright. But it'll only count as one for the challenge, alright? So there we go. There we go. There we go. Alright. So this is just the uh this is just the entryway. All right, that's just the entryway. That's pretty good. Some more here. Now, sometimes it glows, sometimes it doesn't. So don't, just don't blow by. Make sure you're paying attention. See how this is on the ceiling, all right? Uh, those ones at the entrance, uh, you know, a lot of them didn't glow. So keep an eye out for that. You know, just don't blow by them. Uh-oh. <laughs> Come on, big boy. Come on. Shoot him, will ya? Holy jeez. <laughs> All right. All right. Watch out for those ghouls. As I say, it could be a little challenging, but uh, definitely check the walls, check the, you know, the, the ground, check the roof of this place. It's, uh, it could be everywhere, so this uh, brain fungus. Make sure you go inside these little areas here. I can't remember, so, uh, for some reason, I thought some of them had traps. Um, just keep an eye out for that. Is that a melon? Oh, nice. Keep going here. Now, the Wendigo Cave is a little bit of a maze, all right? It, um, so if you're uh, not too sure, just fast travel out. It'll bring you right back to the uh, entryway, so uh, just let you know. Yeah, there's a couple uh, charms there, bone chimes. <clears throat> oh, nice. That's a good cluster right there where you can grab uh, two of them in one cluster like that. That's a bonus. Look at these boys down here. Thirteen thirty-eight. Nice. Ha ha. Love it. I'll take that all day long. Grab that right away. As I said, this is the way back, but, uh, you know, I know it can be a little confusing, but just, just check. Just check, because, like, there is... I would say this Windigo Cave is probably, hands down, the best place for uh, brain fungus. FYI. 
Yeah, so that's where we came from there. Oh, look at this on the ground here, look. See? I would have totally missed it. Keep your eyes open, so we're almost done. And we haven't even, you know, in my experience, put a dent in this uh, Wendigo cave. Should be all kinds in here for a couple players. There. Up there. Uh oh. We just need one more, I think. So just be careful this section here, uh, the Mylarks here. There's uh, sometimes a Mylark King, at least a couple of them anyway. And a couple of Mylark Hunters, look at this big cluster down there. So just be careful of this wide open cavern section. There's, there's usually a couple of Mylark uh, Kings and they're, uh, if you're a low level player, they will uh, mess you up right some good. Go ahead and grab this cluster. Nice, there we go. Like brain fungus, 20 for 20. And as I said, we barely put a dent in this Wendigo, uh, Wendigo cave right here. Hands down, probably the best spot for brain fungus. So there you go. Hope you enjoyed the video. Please like, subscribe, and share when you have the chance. It really helps me out. And I hope you all have a nice day.